So what, what does that actually mean that those two lines are feminine? Is it just... For example, you can see it in Julius Caesar because he says... Because Brutus says, look, set honour in one eye and death in the other, and I will look upon both indifferently. And then Cassius says, in feminine, he says, I know that virtue to be in you, Brutus, as well as I do know your outward favour, your outward you know, demeanour of, well, honour is the subject of my story. And it's all flexible, oh, yeah. and it's all like, I know this, Brutus. And then he says... His story is, I cannot tell what you and other men think of this life, but for my single self, I had as lief not be, as live to be in awe of such a thing as I myself. That's all ten beat masculine endings. Yeah. So it's kind of like, well, it's this, what? that. Yeah, this, I, think, that. I think feminine endings are thoughtful. Yeah. I think masculine endings are thought out. Yeah. Well,